Hey guys, welcome back to Fantail. We are going to make a Fantail Senior Core today. So you can see we're using the the um, draw knife just to remove a lot of this bulk weight. So the core has a mid to low sweet spot, so you can see that edge peaking there. Our spine will also peak in the same place. Um, so it's gonna be a really nice full profile. The aim weight is two pounds 10 to 210.5. So we'll check the um, design up on the screen now. So you can just have a quick look. It's slightly different to our 2000 and or last year's Fantail Core where it had this slight duck bill through to the toe. This one, we start at the mid to low sweet spot and then we're quite flat to the toe, which you'll be able to see. See this first step just removing that bulk and starting to get the spine shape down a little bit flatter to the toe. So with our made to order range, it allows you to pick your handle shape, toe shape, um, obviously the, the overall weight and grade. So this customer's chosen a semi oval handle. So we'll start to get that handle in shape. Um, and then we like to kind of finish off all the shoulders, make sure the toes in order. That's just going to be a square toe. So that's already finished. And then we'll remove, then we will continue to start removing the bulk weight through the profile to get it to where we need to, um, which will be two pounds, 10 ounce.
So we've just completed getting the rough shape, so we've got our dimensions finished. The next step is just kind of smoothing out that shape with the spoke shave first, and then we'll move on to our files. So that was the rough sanding um, with this one really nice thick blade which helps us kind of really smooth out the shape and then we're finishing off with your fine, really fine um, file which helps to just get those fibre ends down. <laughs> That's the handle shape done. Um, the next step, because we've got our finished thickness there, is working that spine shape. So the tone peaks in that mid to low spot and then kind of that little bit of a round, but generally generally quite flat, that spine shape to the, um, to the handle. So we're just gonna file that and get it into shape. <laughs> So the next step is starting to get that weight down. The reason why we kind of start and finish our handle um, before we kind of finish the shape is so we know what we're working with. So at the moment, that's completely finished. Toe shape length is all done. So it's just reducing this profile now in its same shape to get it to the target weight. So as mentioned, two at the moment it's 210.5. We, re we need to remove another two ounce to allow for your grip binding and stickers. So we'll be using this heel shave. We're going to be leaving a lot of willow through this profile, so leave it nice and full. So just taking it down to this line, you can see there on my edge line, and then again just flattening out um, that spine down to the toe. We'll be also checking it through the, making it sure it fits through that back gauge as well.
really close now to the final shape. We've got our, our edge is kind of finished now. The next step, at the moment, our, um, our spine is a little bit too high. We're not quite fitting through that back gauge. So we need to just bring that down a touch. We'll finish that off, kind of profile's nice and full. Our weight is really close to where it needs to be. And then we'll jump on to um, finishing it first on the drum sander. And then we'll move to the orbital finishing, polishing, binding, and then we'll finish it off. And I'll go through the um, specifications and do a ping test for you.
Thanks for making it up to this point, guys. We've just finished off this fantail core. So at the moment, it weighs in at two pounds, 9.7 ounce. We have a, 30 mi a 39 millimeter edge and a 64 millimeter spine. And you can see here, we've got no concaving through the profile. So it's completely full, which will allow for any basically off-center shots are gonna be a lot more forgiving when we have a full profile compared to when we have that slight scalloping, um, it'll be a lot less, a little bit less forgiving, but nice and full through there. We have, which, so this is our core shape, available in lots of different weights. Um, as you can see, we've got that mid to low sweet spot, and then we're flat to the toe. So it's really gonna suit players that like to play a range of shots, but score a lot of their runs off the front foot. So generally, when we're getting four playing our drives, we're hitting the ball slightly lower down on the bat. So this is, obviously you can see a lot of weight in that central to mid to low area. So really gonna perform strongly off the front foot. You've got weight carrying through to the toe. Um, yeah, so we'll give it a quick ping test now. So really, really strong right the way through that profile and right across that, that playing surface as well. We've finished this bat off with a semi-oval handle, a square toe, um, so it sits a lot more stable in the crease. So you'll, you'll see a lot of pro players have that square toe, a um, little bit of an angle so it sits a little bit more stable and finish off with a blue dynamite grip and our blue sticker options. So those are all choices that you have through our website. You can view all of our sticker options. You can go through, choose your shape, weight, grade of willow, and everything like that. If you've got any questions, please send us an email. We'll leave the link below. Um, and really interested to hear what you think of this video, so don't forget to leave a comment below. And if you haven't already, would love it if you had subscribed to our channel. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you in the next one.